Welcome back. You're still watching Morning Live. Now, uh, Kiri Pinknob, in collaboration with the Wits uh, Theatre, bring the art of poetry and sketches to life this Saturday with uh, the Poetry Overload versus Sketching Hard Showcase. The event will have poetry and sketches in different genres. And the show will provide for the young and old with different performances. Now, the showcase takes place tonight at the uh, Wits Main Theatre. Now, tell us more about this. We're joined by Jefferson Bob Shabalala, the Director of Poetry Overload versus Sketching Hard. Good morning. Welcome to Morning Live. Morning to you. Thank All you right. for having me. Give us background. What is Poetry Overload versus Sketching Hard? Um, so we're working in two forms. We're doing spoken word performance and then we're doing comedy performance as well. Mm -hmm. So we've got uh, one half called Poetry Overload, which is where all the genres of poetry come together. And then we've got another one called Sketching Hard, where ki different kinds of comedians play yeah. around. So we're having a what lot of time. What makes these two worlds together? I mean, they all seem so far apart. And, and I think that's what was exciting for us, to see exactly how we can draw the parallels that can entertain audiences at large. Yeah, so we've brought them together. We've got some comics that are doing some poems. Mm -hmm. We've got some poets yeah. that are doing some <laughs> yeah, So it's very fun. Yeah. Yeah, all right. Yeah. So what can we look forward to? Somebody who's hearing this for the first time, what are they going to see tonight? I think the most exciting thing about it is that we're going to be having a lot of young people speaking about very many contemporary themes, but their own take on it. So we're not looking at uh, what is commonly spoken about in the themes. We're looking at like the more subtle, more insightful takes. And then when it comes to the comedians, you're looking at uh, us taking parodies of not so popular topics. Mm -hmm. So the things that we hush away from. And those are going to be coming to the fore. Like what? What do, what do we com comedians not talk about? Well, I mean, we're not looking at a lot of comedians talking about uh, corrective rape. Yeah. Uh, we're not looking at them talking about domestic violence. And uh, we, we're seeing that more in the poetry realm. Mm. And this time around, we're bringing it into the parody satire realm. And uh, likewise with the poets who are always dealing with the more um, heavier issues, as it were. Yeah. We're having them tackle the slightly lighter aspects of life as well. Why is it important for us to dwell into this and, you know, look into issues like these in a different way? I think it's also because a new voice is emerging in the, uh, in the artist's scape as a large whole. So we've got a lot of young people writing new material. We've got a lot of young people performing new material. And uh, in a country where we've got such a great legacy of great artists, mm. it's, we can f easily fall into the trap of doing the same old and same old. And it's quite nice for us to see what the young people have got to say and what they've got to do. So with a dynamic young company of about 15 performers, People can expect a vast array of many things that mm. are going to very, be very intriguing and entertain them. Talk to us about these comedians and these poets that are part of this. Um, how are they selected? Who are they? Um, we're working with a team of trained performers. Uh, so we're working with Jeremiah uh, Mdonga. We're working with Gatla um, It's Tsulunyane. It's people who are improvisers, mm -hmm. people who are singers, people who are dancers people who are choreographers, and then we're taking all their styles and merging them into creating one showcase. Mm. So we're looking at sketches, which are comedy skits, some range between three to four minutes to even ten minutes, mm. and then we're looking at poems that are short, 30 seconds, yeah. some are ten minutes. So it's just like a lovely merge of everything. It's just like a lot of fun, yeah, though. It's yeah. going to be a lot of fun. It's going to be a lot of fun. I think also people are going to be intrigued by how people are collaborating. Mm. Because very often when you go to a comedy show, you've got one stand-up act. Very often when you go to a poetry show, you've got one act as well. But this is a, a nice fuse of all those coming together. And how did the last one go? I believe this is not the first time you're mixing these two worlds oh, together. We, we've been getting such wonderful responses from the audiences. People are really loving the material. They are loving uh, the fresh faces as well because it's not your known faces as it were, but like it's people that are fresh and people that are very capable of mm. bringing the material across. So people have been really coming out and we're expecting them to come out again today. All right, so before I let you go, ticket prices, what time do you start? Give us those details. So we've got two shows today yeah. at the Vitz Main Theatre. They are starting at 3 p.m. and 8 p.m. Uh, ticket prices are 85 rand at the door. All right. Yeah. Bobs, thank you so much for talking to us. Appreciate he it. is thank the you. director of poetry Overload versus Sketching Hard, Jefferson Bobs uh, Shabalala at the Wirtz Theatre uh, today. Well, let's take a nap break. Stay with us.